GCK coming at you, Kathy Kristen, your division manager, as we close out the month of May and kick off for June. I am so excited for those who don't know, we are two weeks away from the playoffs. All right, we work like any sports team in our season, just like football's in the fall, our season in the summer. We had season open on April 20th uh, and have been prepared building momentum, getting ready uh, for the playoffs of Cutco. So what the heck, what are the playoffs? So we call it the playoffs, the push period, our first competition. It's a two week competition where everyone in the nation is competing uh, to see who's gonna win the fees, scholarships, awards, you know, getting their name on the big stage. Uh, maybe they're excited about advancement, whatever it is, but it's, a, it's an opportunity to really push themselves out of their comfort and really get to that next level of them, all right? Um, uh, and, and it's a really cool process. And some people do it because there's personal gains that they want to have and self-confidence. And, and there's some people that have professional gains. They're like, I want these resume boosters. I want to say that I did a sales internship for two with a quarter of a billion dollar a year company. And I got a letter of recommendation saying that I'm someone that someone should hire or bring on to their program. You know, I want to move up in advancement. I'm excited about having a management internship, an entrepreneurship internship. I'm excited about having my own office. I'm excited about being part of our Cutco sales professionals and working with closing gifts or realtors or whatever it might be. There's a goal that most people have uh, to, to help them maximize. And that's our goal as managers, as leaders for you, help you maximize uh, your opportunity with Cutco in a two week period, providing you with an experience to help you learn and grow personally, professionally, and financially. And I will tell you guys what the Alliance is. It's a, it's a group of people. We call it our starting lineup. They're just locking arms uh, going towards a common goal. These individuals uh, work together every day. We split up into teams. We have fun competitions. We meet together every morning for two weeks, Monday through Saturday. Every morning we have breakfast together. Uh, we do some motivation. We review stats. Uh, we do some teaching and we kick off the day together. We make phone calls together and then they make their day. Uh, and they're committing to saying, hey, for these two weeks, uh, my goal is to average three or more Appointments, all right, completing 40 appointments in a two-week period. It's about three appointments a day. Some people take this time to say, you know, I've already done that. I, I, I want to stretch myself. I want to do something bigger. I want to go after. And they'll they'll do five appointments, seven appointments, 10 appointments a day, multiple days a week. And so you're going to see a lot of different things. But we're looking for people who are excited to grow, who are excited to learn, uh, who are willing to show up uh, for a common cause, and, and also have personal goals that they're excited about. Think about the benefits for our individuals who are part of this how they grow uh, personally, you know, and the opportunity to really uh, get out there and do something that you've never done before. Like I think about our earners, financially how people grow, holy moly. Um, our, our young people are earning more in that two week period than, they, than the average uh, student makes in an entire summer. You know, our top individuals and people who really go after it. I mean, our top earner last year, he was going after all time national record. That was the next level of him putting himself out of his comfort zone. It's like, I'm going for the national record. Uh, and his, uh, he, he uh, did a great job. Uh, he didn't get to break the record, uh, but he earned over $50,000 in income, which was pretty cool. And his mentor, who was coaching him through the process, actually broke the national record. It was so cool to watch them during the push period do something like that. But it's about breaking records, it's about breaking records for yourself, whatever that is for you. It's about breaking barriers that you have mentally. You know, one of my top guys, he said, I want to do this because I always quit. I always quit on things, Kathy. Like when things get tough, like I just give up. And, and for me, I just, I want to commit to something and follow it through all the way, even if it doesn't go well, you know, like I just, I want to say that I did it, that I committed to something and I actually saw it through. Like that would make me feel really myself and even for my parents to know that if I really committed to something, I can do it, you know, and maybe it's a mental block for you like that, that you're like really wanting to push through. And you're like, I want to do this because this is, this is what I want to do. Maybe it's communication skills. Maybe it's self-confidence. There's personal goals that you might have that in this two week internship, uh, and, and that's basically what it is, a two week sales internship that I want to learn about myself, how I communicate with people. I want to get better at uh, discipline, organization, you know, responsibility, waking up, whatever it might be. And for some of you, it's professionally. You're like, I really want to be able to put on my resume uh, that I was part of the ship for a quarter of a billion dollar company uh, that for two weeks I did this. I was selected as a top performer. I ended up being in the top 1%, you know, for the company. And, and this is an elite group of people. And so we work with them and coach them to help them be at the top. Uh, those who complete the two weeks will get a lot of recommendation from myself and have an opportunity based on performance to earn a hand-signed letter of recommendation from the president of our company, which is really incredible, all right? 
right? Also, there's opportunities for the internships. And so for us, the people who step up during these two weeks make a name for themselves. And this is our sales interns, our management interns, our marketing interns, entrepreneurship uh, interns, and they're at and do internships with our company that are going to really set them apart for the future. And some people decide, man, I actually want to grow here. I love this place like I did, you know, and whether as a manager, uh, they enjoy coaching and teaching others and doing that professionally, or they enjoy the sales aspect and they love meeting with clients working with people and they want to work as a Cutco sales professional. They are incredible opportunities for advancement within our company for you to see it. So what's coming up? I want to walk you through real quick the calendar of events so you guys know. Um, as we kick off the month of June, on Friday, June 5th, I will be running a sales leadership development meeting. This is a small, intimate uh, coaching session. You only go to one of these in your whole life where I cover some of the tips that helped me earn $22,000 my first summer. Tips on recommendations, phones, and closing that my manager taught me that I pass on to you all. All right. Uh, then on Tuesday, June 9th, we have our Alliance 10K Bootcamp. And this is everyone part of the Alliance that kicks off on the 15th. We will be meeting together throughout the Gulf Coast Division. We also will have some guest speakers from one of the top, some of the first nationally, uh, sharing uh, insights on how to have a great push and, and really be able to answer questions and help you guys think big about that opportunity. All right. Uh, so that will be on June 9th or 11th. Most offices will be having a night. Talk to you to find out when yours is and we will be talking with the parents and sharing with them what the heck of what to expect why we're doing this the best for you personally professionally and financially how this will serve you for your future i have never had a member of my alliance uh that has not that i haven't you know bumped it two years later uh and not talked about uh the alliance the push period every single time i see my alumni they're Oh my gosh, I remember that first summer and that push, like waking up in the mornings and how you coached us and taught us. And there's so many things and it's something that you'll remember for a lifetime being part of that group. Uh, the relationships you make and the connections as well. And by the way, some of these could be future business partners, you know, that you'll meet here uh, in Cutco, in Vector. Some of them will become some of your best friends that you'll have for a lifetime. Uh, and we've also seen uh, people who have met their significant others um, during that time as well, which is pretty nuts. Uh, so how do you get connected? Talk to your manager, all right? Make sure to ask, how can I be a part of this group? All right, they'll be doing an information session. Um, uh, throughout the week, there'll be different information sessions talking about what we're looking for, what the push is, what the alliance, what it's gonna do for you in more detail. And so ask them where you can sit down and join. And I will say this, you want to make sure you take time to get your skills down. Do you have your closing down? Have you met with a manager and gotten a check? Do you have your recommendations down? Is your goal slide deck made? Do you have recommendations uh, binder or notebook uh, or a virtual spreadsheet that you're sharing with customers and sharing with what people are giving you? Make sure that that's set up properly, all right? Have you gotten uh, checked on how you are on the phones, right? Has your manager listened to you? Are you building urgency and firming up the right way? These next two weeks are about making sure your foundations are on lockdown as we go into the push period. And obviously you're gonna keep getting better and better and better, but do you have your basics? Memorize your closing, memorize your racks, get comfortable with your phone approach. That's gonna make a big difference. And the last thing you guys wanna make sure you do in preparation is is increase uh, your uh, initial names list, all right? Your managers will be running workshops on how to create an attack list of 300 plus people, all right? And sharing different resources and activities you can do to help you increase that. It is up to you to take action on that, all right? So I encourage you guys, get to it. Don't wait another minute, don't wait another day. The clock's ticking, we've got two weeks until go time. And depending on when you're listening to this, maybe less, all right? I wish you guys an incredible two weeks of momentum as we build towards uh, the SC1 push. I wish you guys, I hope to see you all um, reserve your spot for Monday, uh, June 15th. We'll be meeting as a division. It's like our big pep rally. All 24 offices will be together. Uh, we will have some great content. You will hear uh, from some of the most incredible Hall of Fame Cutco sales professionals to help you guys kick off the biggest two weeks of your career and two weeks that you will remember for a lifetime. All right. So I hope to see you there. And then uh, the, the closing ceremonies will be recognizing performers. Uh,
chance for you guys to mix and mingle with the best of the best will be on July 1st. There will be a limited amount of seats available for that. Um, so you want to make sure to reserve your spot uh, so that you have a spot for July 1st. So talk to your manager about that as well. All right. Uh, cheers to a killer June and an incredible playoffs. Can't wait to meet you guys.